More breaking news coming in this morning and this one from the national capital where the Delhi, where the air quality has dipped just ahead of Diwali. Air quality in areas like Anand Vihar, Siri Fort and Dwarka are in very poor category this morning. I'm joined by my colleague Ayushman Kumar who's been tracking the story. Ayushman, so what we can see over here is several areas which we have seen in the past also being problem areas. Anand Vihar, Siri Fort, in this case Dwarka and Rohini also in very pure, poor category and Diwali celebrations are about to start but this has happened just ahead. Yes, in fact, uh, if you look at the air quality right now in Anand Vihar, it is in the very poor category and Siri Fort, Dwarka, Rohini, all of them are in very poor category. In the other areas, if you go, they are still in poor category. The moderate areas in Delhi are right now uh, ranging between the poor category. All these areas till yesterday and day before yesterday were somewhere between moderate and poor category. Now they have the air quality has plunged into very poor category. If you talk about the situation right now, the government has said that they are organizing a central festival of Diwali so that people don't burst cracker and for that the preparation has been done at central uh, CP but that seems unlikely because crackers will be bursted in Delhi and you can expect the air quality to plummet down further in the national capital and also in Punjab and Haryana the stubble burning is taking place so uh, in the past few days, we saw the air quality improving because of the uh, northwesterly wind blowing and a bit of rain taking place in some of the areas. But again, with the stagnant uh, uh, air uh, and the temperature dipping down, the air quality has further uh, plunged and you can see the air quality ranging between very poor to poor in all across the national capital and NCR region. Right, Aishman, also quickly, we have in fact seen that the 10-member task force, the, uh, the graded response action team, has in fact suggested that there should be partial ban on construction. By partial ban, we mean ban between a certain time period during the day. Uh, it was a recommendation from them. Any decision on that yet? Well, uh, if you talk about the CPCB, uh, this came yesterday and prior to that uh, on the uh, uh, day before yesterday, CPCB is a task force has also recommended that between October 26th to October 30th, no construction should take place because the uh, task force feels that in order to mitigate the dust that uh, generates from the construction, uh, at least one of the factors can be uh, stopped. And that is why they have also proposed that there should be a ban on construction between 26th of October and 30th of October. The CPCB task force have been there on ground and they have been saying that two of the major uh, pollutants uh, are the road dust and the construction dust and dumping of the construction and destruction waste. And the government has been uh, uh, telling the Punjab government and Haryana government to uh, have a control over the stubble burning, which in fact has not resulted. Right. You can still see Punjab and Haryana Trouble burning is happening there. Right, Ayushman, thank you so much for bringing us the latest on that situation.